portuguesa is a Portuguese word. I'm Brazilian, if you don't know, and we speak Portuguese. Freguesa means loyal client, but it's not like just loyal client as in somebody who, you know, buys from you all the time. It's that idea of when you walk into a coffee shop and the barista already starts making your order because they know that's your go-to order. It's that idea of, I have gone to the same hairstylist for the past six years and that she has seen my children grow up. She asks me how my mom is doing. We have a connection. When I was brainstorming names, this was even before I thought that any of this was going to be possible. I knew I wanted it to be something that connected to who I am. I want something that evokes connection. And immediately the word for this I came to mind. But this idea that you walk into your local bakery and they already know that you usually order a croissant and a latte. As a style coach, my whole philosophy is that when women feel put together, they can show up more fully present for their people. And that's what I wanted to bring into our brand as well. I wanted to have a feeling of whenever you put our pieces on, you can feel like you can connect better with the people around you. Not because there's something magical about it, but it's just like that little reminder to your brain whenever you put your cute little necklace on or your hat, you're like, oh, I'm ready to make connections. Because guess what? I'm gonna, can you let me get nerdy for just a second? The longest Harvard study is a 50 year study. They follow these young men well into old age. And what they found is that the biggest marker for longevity and not just longevity as in like a long life, but a good life, right? Was the quality of the relationships in their midlife, their connections and how they connected with people. We are wired for that. That's what we were made to do. I believe that we are all happier and better when we feel like we belong somewhere.